Hey there, my friend, this is Paul Hutchings coming to you live from my home office here in Southeast Idaho. And uh, today is a special day. It is March 27th, 2013. And for the last 90 days, every single day, I have been visualizing a day. And that day I've been visualizing is April 1st, which is actually a few days from now. However, the goal day that I've been visualizing is actually happening today. It's happening early March 27, 2013. And today is the day where my wife and I uh, are dropping the kids off and we are taking a check into the credit union to pay off the remaining balance of our mortgage on the home that we just bought about six months ago. So this is a huge day for us. Uh, it's a day that it has been in the making really for about eight years. Ever since I got into the home business profession, um, when I first read the book, Rich Dad, Poor Dad, uh, we've always had this goal of owning our own home and not having a mortgage. So today is the culmination of that. And as exciting as it is to pay off the mortgage, and as exciting as you know all of the great comments that I've been getting from all of the wonderful people that are in my life, there was one comment that was sent to me this morning um, that brought tears to my eyes when I read it the first time. It brought tears to my eyes when I read it the second time. And it's probably going to bring tears to my eyes as I read it for you on this video. And it was a message that was sent to me by my good friend, my dear friend, someone who I respect and admire and believe in uh, so much. Her name is Mahara Tucker, someone who I've been working with for um, probably about a year now, if not, if not longer. Mahara wrote this to me in my Facebook message. She said, <clears throat> and it really encapsulates what this day really means, what this day really means, okay? Because there's a lot of surface stuff, uh, but what this day really means for me, Mahara just, she, she just looked right inside my soul and articulated this perfectly. She wrote, Paul, you made me cry. I know you will be flooded with congrats all day. People will think it is so cool. <laughs> I want to quietly acknowledge the part that some people don't see. I remember you telling me how many hours you struggled with just the simple blog header. I know you could have not have made it without shedding a tear or being put down or facing a long progression of obstacles. <clears throat> this is my different way of honoring you. For every long day you spent at XYZ Company, and she knows the company that I was working at before I ventured off into the home business profession, my job, right? For every long day you spent at your job, for every single prospect that was ever rude to you, for every comp plan that turned out to be bull crap, for the times you wanted to buy something special for Kareem, but you didn't have the money, for the very first day, you had the courage to start a mastermind with only one person listening. For every condescending relative that thought you should get a real job, <clears throat> here's to all the moments you did the work, but in the wrong business. Here's to the hours of conflict and soul searching you must have done before you changed your focus to your current endeavor. And obviously she knows the name of the company I'm working at and she's working with us, so <laughs> I'll leave the name out before you changed uh, your focus to your current endeavor. Here's to every technical difficulty or embarrassing presentation <laughs> that did not go well. <laughs> the boy were there plenty of those. Here's to the Paul that was worried and hurting, but decided to try yet another business from home. When there was no guarantee of success, and there was plenty of reason to doubt, Paying off your mortgage is just the evidence of your real accomplishment. Pay attention to that. Paying off your mortgage is just the evidence of your real accomplishment. My special friend, I can see the magnitude of what it took to get you there. 
That is what inspires me to continue wading through it all for myself. However much you think it means to me, it means more than that. Thank you, Paul. Wow. <clears throat> wow. That's what it really means. <clears throat> you know, the money, the recognition, the paying off the house, all, all the surface stuff. Mehera, what you just wrote in this message is what it really means. And I want to thank you for pointing that out to me and helping me remember all the things that I did go through and all the things that we all have to go through if we really want to do something special in life. Sitting on the toilet in the back or bathroom of that 1984 Fleetwood Vogue at 5 o'clock in the morning before I went to work. Memorizing the sales presentation for my first network marketing company that I gave again and again and again and again for 12 months straight <laughs> without making any money. <laughs> oh, Harry, you brought back a lot of memories. So thank you for that. Thank you for helping me and many others to be cognizant of what, what we're really doing here in the home business profession. And I'm excited. I'm excited to continue fighting for the, my freedom, the freedom of my family, and your freedom, and the freedom of all of the many wonderful people who don't yet know that they can have freedom, that freedom can be a reality, that dreams really can come true. Is it easy? <laughs> Well, it hasn't been for me. <laughs> Might be for some people. Um, but it's worth it. It's worth every single moment. Every single frustration. Every single success. Every single temporary setback. Every single rejection. Every single moment of self-doubt. Every single moment. Every single tear. All worth it. And more. To be embracing my freedom. And uh, it's just the beginning, you know? Just, wow, amazing. So, my friend, hey, thanks for sharing this special moment with me. I've gotta take this camera and head out to the kitchen where my wife is waiting, where we're gonna pull out the checkbook and write that check for that last mortgage payment. Um, never give up on your dreams, my friend. Never give up on your dreams. I believe in you. I do know that miracles can happen when we focus on finding principles and laws and endeavoring to conform ourselves to those principles and laws. And um, that's it for now. Make it a great day. We'll talk soon.